the treatment options for aortic stenosis are replacement of the aortic valve either with surgery or by using a transcatheter modality because it is a mechanical obstruction that means the blood flow from the heart is not able to go through the entire uh, organs of the body so because of that mechanical problem has to be only by removing the obstruction so that removal of the obstruction is by implanting a new heart valve till recently that means about a decade ago we used to send these patients for surgery and because as we already know that this is a disease of 75s and 85s and 90s people when we these patients undergo for aortic valve replacement the surgery is turned down by the surgeon because they are prohibitively high risk for a open heart surgery so that is the reason why people started looking for some other options that is where the birth of the transcatheter aortic valve replacement has happened in the year 2002 so over the past two decades this technology and technology have refined to the stage where currently in 2020 about 200000 people underwent transcatheter aortic valve replacement globally whereas in a transcatheter aortic valve replacement what we perform is we pass the aortic valve from the groin using a plastic tube called as the catheter and implant the artificial valve at the location of the native valve so this implantation of the valve can be either with the balloon assistance like what we are seeing here or sometimes by using a self expanding valve we place a valve there so this type of patients of a transcatheter aortic valve replacement need not stay for long in the hospital because there is no cutting of the chest or any stopping of the heart the complications of surgery or complications of the procedure are much less compared to that of a surgical aortic valve replacement that is and in addition most of these patients have got associated problems like elderly age they have got blocks in the other systems they have got blocks in the heart vessels they might have increased creatinine level or a frank kidney failure so all those patients are high risk for surgery so transcatheter aortic valve replacement is replacing surgical aortic valve replacement as the treatment of choice for aortic stenosis